the Southeast Zone on Sunday declared that it would not implement the community policing template rolled out by the police hierarchy. This was contained in a communique presented by the Zone after their enlarged meeting in Enugu. The communique was read by Chairman of the Forum and a Boeing State Governor, Chief David Umahi. Daily Post reports that it was flanked by the host Governor Ifanye Uguayin, their Imo State counterpart, Senator Hope Uzodima, Deputy Governor of Anambra State, Dr. Ikem Okeke, his Abia State counterpart, Right Honorable Ude Oko Chuku, President General of Oanese Indigo, Chief Naya Wondo, the OB of Onicha, His Royal Highness, His Royal Majesty Igwe Alfred Achebe, Senator Dr. Jim Umobodo, Chief Emmanuel Uwanyawu, Chairman of the Christian Association of Nigeria, Khan, Southeast Bishop Godwin Okafo, among others. They accused the Inspector General of Police, Mr. Adamu Abubakar, of going contrary to earlier agreements they reached on the matter. The recent communications from the Inspector General of Police to our governors on community policing composition is not in keeping with the agreement we reached with him during his first his last visit to the Southeast. In the circumstance, we cannot begin implementation of it until the program reflects our earlier agreements. The Southeast governors and their leaders request the IGP to revert to our initial agreement reached on community policing at Enugu, the governors said. Meanwhile, the governors have also directed all Igbos living in, in and outside Igbo land to obey all the extant restriction orders by the presidency and the state government where they live as well as other precautionary measures by the World Health Organization, WHO, Nigerian Center, Nigeria Center for Disease Control, NCDC, and so on, for the containment of the spread of the novel, novel coronavirus disease, COVID-19. The forum resolved to further engage the NCDC to scape up testing of COVID-19 in the Southeast states. According to Humahi, the forum agreed that all Southeast state houses of assembly should commence the process of enacting the state security laws in line with the Southeast Joint Security Program. On rejigging the economy, on rejigging of the economy, Huma is stated that the meeting agreed to set up committees in our various states to work with FGN, World Bank, CBN, and S NSAI in their various programs lined up to rejig the economy, especially in the areas of agriculture, SME, and solid minerals. Speaking further, he said that the meeting agreed to hold a virtual meeting with the group MD of NMPC on the issue of linking our southeast state capitals with gas pipeline alongside with the pipeline program of federal government of Nigeria, which is running from Imo state to Lagos state. On the rehabilitation of the Akanum Ibiam International Airport, Enugu, the forum after receiving brief of progress of work from the chairman, Southeast Governors Committee on the Airport, Engineer Chris Okoye, commended President Muhammad Obari, the Minister of Aviation, Governor Ifai Oguwai, other Southeast Governors and members of the Airport Committee. The governors assured the people of the zone that with the progress of work, we are hopefully we are hopeful that the airport will reopen soonest, subject to COVID-19 federal government's program. The forum also commended President Buari, Minister of Works, and Governor Willie Obiano of Anambra State for the work progress on the second Niger Bridge, being handled by Julius Bega. Uma is said that the meeting equally agreed that the leadership of the Oranes Indigo submit a working document in our next meeting on setting up of Southeast Stabilization Fund, concluding that the next Executive Committee meeting of the Southeast Traditional Institution shall be hosted by a Boeing State. Okay. Those were the things that they discussed uh, during the meeting, but I think the most important one now is that it's like a, in a nutshell, the IGP is trying to change everything. Like they said that uh, from their initial their initial agreement, and the man came back and began to sing a different song, and they said they reject it 
in totality is giving them something different from what they agreed on in his first visit, then why changing it? And even if he's telling them the reason why he's changing it, I think they are not comfortable with the whole thing. And you know, when you talk about security, you know, it's all encompassing and it's being given, it's, 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 it's been a big debate and it's big, a, a, a big problem, most especially with this uh, issue of a uh, SMA. So we don't even know what they agreed before and what the man is presenting to them again. But now they are rejecting it outrightly. They reject the community policing templates, which templates were they having before? Okay. I remember that the man who is your terror, Abba Kiari, is no more. Stand on your feet and form South East Security Outfit as South West did. Okay, they have come again. That is what they did to Ujuku at Aburi, Ghana, after all the agreement with Gowan. They come back and go contrary to the agreement. It can never happen again. Ah, I hope if these people can really stand uh, on their feet and say, no, this is what they want, if they will not compromise at the end of the day, because it is compromise that is always bringing all this kind of a thing. I think uh, these people should have known better. They should know better what is going to be good for them. You don't just think about yourself alone, because at the end of the day, if anything happens to the zone, no matter how you think, how, how think, uh, you, think you are secured, it will definitely catch up with you, no matter what. What is the content of the referred agreement? This does not pass for a, a, a news material since uh, the details of the particular agreement was not disclosed in this bulletin. Please publish it along uh, the IG's template so that we compare and contrast. Exactly. Okay. Someone said, it is not for drunkard like you and your father. Security matters are not discussed in the public, you can imagine. Okay. Someone said, do not... Look at the IGP Nigeria. He can never do anything that will be against his Fulani kinsmen, which is is representing an interesting in an interest somehow. Hmm. You people should be radical and behave like the Yoruba governors who never listen to federal government directives. The issue of self preservation is inherent in human existence. No stranger will do his best for you except the indigenous people okay uh someone is saying there that say uh, why community policing at the first place why not amotekun like okay remember that the igp is a member of the full energy jihadists, so it will give you what we allow them to carry out their plans resist him totally our able governors this is no time for joke there is an evil agenda we have to act fast any mistake once done cannot be corrected again. So, Southeastern governors should be careful now that Nigeria has no government in place. Go ahead and establish your own Amotekun. Even we know for. <laughs> Good. The governors realize the intrigues being played here. Everything about this present administration in the name of gift is Greek. Fake. In nature... Especially coming from Buari to South East. Hey, good stand by the governors. Maintain it all. Good luck to you. No compromise at the end of the day. If you compromise, mm -hmm, you will hear her. You will later hear her. Fulani, Fulani, how many times did I call you? Your cup don't fool and overflow. Continue. Fulani, IGP. Continue. Fulani, appointing governors. Okay, let's see how it's going to end at the end of the day. Should the head of the family wait for the village head? On a journey to return before deciding and taking the dying child to the hospital, he knows he knows he can heal the child. Okay, this is history trying to repeat itself. The same way Ojuku had had reached certain agreements with Gowan in Aburi, Gowan came back and his hands twisted by the powers that be. Then he changed the agreements he reached with Ojuku. Thank God that the governors of South East are holding their grounds. That is the way forward. Another Aburi called broken. Okay, thank God Hope Uzodima Kiyari cannot override the decisions of the rest of the governors. Please, our governors in, and leaders of the South East, stand firm on the ground. Okay and defend your people. The IGP is not a friend of the Igbos. Our God will see us through. In Jesus' name. Thank God you guys refused. Why community policing now that the Fulanis are everywhere in the East? Only God uh, in heaven knows 
this uh, people's agenda. <laughs> I think everybody is commending the South Seas governors and their, the leadership that they should just stand and be firm on this rejection. They should not just compromise. So guys, what do you think? Leave your comments and let's have your take.